are coming up on City of the Rocks. It's about halfway between Silver City and Deming. Nala's having a blast chasing things. Chasing things? Yeah, she just saw another lizard. <laughs> through there and come back around. She's not going to. Come on, Nala, let's go. Oh. Nala, come on. Come on, go in front of me. She's doing it. Don't go too fast. I've got not the right shoes. <laughs> and this is really narrower than it looked. So I can't fit? No, I can't. I barely fit. I didn't realize how narrow it was. Nala, don't drag me down the hill. It be rattlesnakes in there. No, it's all rock. Yeah, but the snakes left the rock.
drove along a river, passed through several little towns, and now I guess we're at the top here and we're gonna head over to Silver City and backtrack around and head back down. We're here in Silver City and we're gonna be heading over to the Little Toad Creek Brewery and Distillery. They are dog friendly. I'm so nervous about this. Should I go check it out first and come back? Sure. Okay, I'll walk and check it out. Are you all right with that? Yeah. Okay. Sorry, I didn't get any footage while in the restaurant, guys. We were taking our dogs in through there for the first time. This is only the second time that we've taken them to a restaurant. Now, I've taken Nala to the brewery in Newton a couple times, but that's outside completely. They did really, really well. So when you go to the Little Toad Creek Brewery here in Silver City, you just go in and you take your dogs all the way to the back. I went in first to just scout out the area to see exactly where to go and see how many people were in there because I was a little nervous taking our dogs around a very stimulus type environment, but the dogs did great. There was only like two other people sitting in the area where we were sitting. And of course we had the service come in through and stuff like that. Honestly, they behaved themselves wonderfully. Of course, Roxy is a little spaz. She always is. But Nala did really, really well for not really being in that kind of environment, enclosed with people, new surroundings. She just laid down under the table for the most part. But yeah, I didn't film anything because, again, I didn't want to be distracted when I'm dealing with the dogs. But the only disappointment I have with this is they stopped canning their beers. You can only get them if you go in the restaurant. And I wanted to take them back to Iowa like I did the last time to give to my friends. And I can't because all you can get is growlers and they're not going to last three weeks. So that was really, really disappointing. Uh, the food is average. Now, when you say it's average... Yeah. It's not it's not bad. The food is not bad. But the service is wonderful. They're very, very friendly. And the beers, I love their beers. Um, they've got a really nice um, uh, porter and a good IPA that I uh, love. I like the Grumpy Old to to the Grumpy Old Troll IPA is my one of my favorites. And Pideo Pideo Pendejo. And Robin it's likes like Pendejo. Pendejo. And Robin likes the pende say it, Robin. Pendejo. Porter. And, <laughs> and that is really, really. I don't even say it right, but I say it better than you. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, we're going to take our doggies home. Did you enjoy dinner? Oh, hi, Nala. Hi, Nala Bean. How are you? You're a good dog. Again, this is why you rescue dogs. This is the bestest dog I've ever had. Seriously. And she was a rescue. She is a mutt. But she was a rescue. And she is one of the best dogs I've ever, ever had. So, definitely. If you could have a designer pup, you should design it like her. Yeah. Or go to the rescue. <laughs> yeah. You just contradicted everything what I said. No, a designer pup is like a bunch of different mixes of dogs. Yeah. I'm saying if you could design one, you'd want to design one third her. Catahoula, one third Australian Shepherd, one third Australian Cattle Dog or Blue Hiller. Mm -hmm. That is what she is. She's, three, her three, three. eyes are showing Catahoula. Her softness may be her, Australian Shepherd. Yeah. But her her look is Cattle Dog. Yeah. But her her hair, her fur is so soft. She's the softest thing ever. Oh, I love her so much. All right, so we are going to head back to our campsite and oh, campsite, our property that's over in Dimming. And I've really got to get the shed point painted. So tomorrow you're going to see me get a lot of work done. I'm going to probably try to start at 6 a.m. And I've got to scrape all the old paint off. And that's probably going to take, based on my calculations, about six hours. So, it's not going to be a fun day. See you tomorrow.